What's up guys and welcome back to Gas Station Simulator. If you're excited to see more from this game, make sure you leave a like on the video. It'd be greatly appreciated. As you can see, we've started out during a rave, which is awesome. But today we're going to be checking out the new Tidal Wave DLC. To be honest, I don't even know how to initiate it. So let me try to figure that out. Yeah, I got no idea how to enable this thing dude it, it should be listed over here but i'm actually playing this prior to its official release date which should be when this episode actually comes out march 22nd so hopefully you guys are gonna check this out as well it's not gonna be this difficult for you guys but i'm thinking let me save really quick i'm thinking this is a new game type of thing wait what tidal wave it's totally a new game type of thing here we go, we have the classic Dust Bowl and the new Tidal Wave area. I'm pretty stoked about this. It looks very like Tiki inspired. Oh, we get a cutscene too? This is sick. Was not expecting this. And some bird poop on the shoulder. Check this out, dude. Oh, that's some boat too. Classic Jack Sparrow move right here. I, I respect that. That's kind of great. There we are. Oh, and I didn't realize we had little spider hands on our... Spider hands. Spider tattoos on our hands. I'm just getting started, dude. I can't I can't lose it already. Okay, I don't, I don't need to read nothing. I just want to check this out firsthand. See what it's all about. Refuel boats. This is a really, really cool already. Okay, we've got a big dumpster over there. That's good. I have to keep that in mind. Here's our register. Nice. We've still got our little computer as well. What is Chun Chu Manchu? There's a volcano. <laughs> of course. Of course there's a volcano, dude. And a lot of fish. Wow, a lot of fish on the ground. Okie dokie. Yeah, we're gonna have to we're gonna have to clean this place up quite a bit. But it looks like we're not even starting here. There's a, a little waypoint out here. We'll see what this has to offer. Oh, there are actually cars here as well, though. It's not just going to be boats. I was kind of worried about that. Oh, this is our power. Let's get her kicked on, dude. Get them tiki torches lit. This is about to be such a cool little spot. There it is. Oh, and there's the volcano. Yeah. Cool. So is there, is there a possibility that the whole place could burn down after a volcanic eruption? I do like that you can see it off in the distance, though. Let's get back in here, and let's get her opened up. No, we're going back to the docks. Take a gift to the volcano. Yeah, they would, they would probably accept that. That's one of our many, many prestigious awards that we've won at our previous gas station. Okay, this is just lava here. We can walk across, jump up, little staircase. Okay, into the cauldron. Sacrificial gift. It's worth $250, apparently. Let's go ahead and sacrifice it. Task complete. There we go. Faithful servant. The island is ruled by a mysterious god named Chun Chu Manchu. It's going to take me a while to get that down. Uh, manifesting as the volcano. The volcano icon at the top of the screen shows the anger, blah, 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 blah. Now we're ready, though, right? We've got the power on. We've got our dumpster. Sick. I'm not sure why we have a waypoint going to that. Oh, it's because our current task is to clean up the gas station. I know it would help if I read, but reading, it takes so much time, man. I'm just, I'm here to play games. This place does have a really good atmosphere, though. So much better than the Dust Bowl. And the fact that there's not that big cloud of dust just constantly rolling around here, though we, we do have the volcano to worry about now, that's that's really nice. Okay, uh, I think it's probably about time that we call some people to come clear out our dumpster because it's already full. Local trash collection. There it is. Done deal. Wait, is it immediate? No. Okay, they are gonna they are gonna have to bring a truck out. Never mind, they are going to bring a boat. They are going to bring a boat out here. That's sick. Well maybe. No, that's 
Okay, false alarm. Sorry, sorry to get you guys excited. It's it's not a boat. There's still a bunch of small stuff, like all the fish and whatnot. Oh, wait. We don't have any of our old tools or anything, dude. We're starting fresh. Okay, so what we need then is under tools, we need a broom. We need a trash bag. And that's all we can do for right now. This music is a vibe and a half. Wait, how much money we got? 1900 bucks? Yeah, we can splurge a little. Get a warehouse. Look at that sucker out there, dude. That is nice. Uh, you have managed to calm the volcano. Oh, and he's, he's blowing some smoke rings. Isn't that sweet? We get it! You vape! I wonder how often we're gonna have to make sacrifices to the volcano. Kinda thinking maybe we should keep some of these fish around? They, they might be a good sacrifice. You never know. We're almost done cleaning this place up, though. I think now we really, truly just have the, the small things we can get with our trash can, our trash bag. We're gonna order us a little bit of fuel here while we finish cleaning. Fuel supply, we just need a hunted. Just a hunted to get us going. Easy dub. All right, I need to try to, I need to try to make, just drain one basket in the dumpster right over yonder. That's gotta be 100%, right? It's gonna be short. No freaking way, dude. They counted that? It didn't even go in. Wait, what the heck is this? Is that a bunch of coral? Okay, we got some like barnacles or, or coral or something growing back here. This is really cool too. No way, you know what this means though? You guys, our shipments are going to actually, this time, actually going to be delivered via boat. That is crazy. Okay, well, we're gonna have to come back here to get that cleaned up as well. But let me let me finish the front first. And I think that boat out yonder, that might be our fuel vessel coming to refill us. We, where is our gas tank? Or where are the gas tanks? Must just be this guy, at least for right now. Oh, that's a much smaller boat than I was expecting. Dude, look at all the fish out there, too. I got such, like, squirrel energy right now, and I'm really sorry about that, but it's just, it's a lot to take in, and I'm really, really loving it so far. He probably, probably won't need any help from us, but I definitely want to get a, a better look at that boat. I just got to take care of these bass in here real quick, and then we'll go, we'll go check that out. He pulled up where I definitely was not expecting him to. Oh, there's a little, there's a little nozzle over there. And there is actually a guy in the boat. I have to know. I have to know. This isn't a bass though. This is a much more rare fish species that we've not come across until now. Let's see what happens. Wait, I can't, I can't do it because it has to be something that goes into my inventory. Dang it. Hey, it was worth a shot though, right? This is the last of the barrels. We've got to order uh, another pickup for that as well. There's there's a couple more on the beach, but I'm not super concerned about them just yet. What we really need to be worried about is cleaning up this warehouse because I don't think that the fuel delivery boat is actually going to leave until that's done. A few moments later. Yeah, we're going to need another pickup like stat that's that's a lot of coral dude that is a lot of coral we've still got one more thing to do down here the valve this whole time this poor guy's just been sat here in his dang boat waiting for us because i was too stupid to notice the valve i was out here worried about the worried about the barnacles and all the coral and whatnot turns out it didn't even matter well it it looks Quite a bit nicer up here, minus all the fish. Let's probably take care of those next. Wait, is this our first customer? Hold on, hold on, hold on. I'm not I'm not ready. Sir, I am not ready. Okay, now I think I'm ready. Got your boat right over there. The nozzle does kind of move around. Or the the port that we're supposed to put the nozzle moves around. So that's a little tricky. But there we go. You are welcome, sir. Enjoy the uh enjoy the waves out there. What do we gotta do up here? Does that just let people know that we're open? 
I guess so. Wait, but we don't have any... We don't have any land pumps. We just have the one on the water. It wants us to go fill up another boat. So while we wait for our next customer to arrive, I'm going to keep cleaning this area. I think somebody's pulling up. Let's climb up our little bamboo ladder over here. Hang on a minute, sir. I will be right with you. See, this is so sick, you guys. So sick. It's just, it's, it's so different, yet so similar to, uh, to what we know and love, you know, out at, out at the Dust Bowl. But this is just refreshing, I think, more than anything else. Oh, yeah, left shift. I forgot about that. Hey, you're a lifesaver. There it is. There it is. We got another one. This one sounds a little bit different. Oh, it's a dang jet ski, dude. No wonder it didn't sound the same. Afternoon, how we doing? Got your little port right there. Perfect. We'll fill you on up. That'll do. Have a good one. Enjoy the swells. It looks like it's kind of picking up out there. I'm coming. I'm coming. I'm coming. Sorry about the weights. I'm uh, almost finished up cleaning out the warehouse now. Super. Super. Have a good one, sir. Enjoy the rest of your night. Now that I've managed to get all these other barnacles and pieces of coral and whatever else thrown up from down there up to here, I'll be able to throw them in the dumpster. It didn't really make sense to me to try to like walk them all up the ladder. You know, that would have that would have taken way too much time. Looks like we got another jet skier that just pulled up. I wonder, could I make this jump onto that pillar and then up and over? Easy. It is too easy. How you doing today, sir? Good. Thank you. You are welcome. They're, they're all wearing wetsuits, too. Every single one of them. Our total fuel is now low. So, yeah, we've got a computer in here. Let's get another hunted. Another cool hunted. Hopefully we have enough left in the tank to help this guy out. Purple. Purple wetsuit this time around. Let's see what we've got. Afternoon, sir. Oh, yeah, plenty. Thanks a bunch. You are welcome. Enjoy your day. You know what I just realized? We witnessed this whole warehouse be constructed. We, we saw the entire thing. There was nothing out here. And then in the blink of an eye, all of a sudden, this thing just appeared. So that means whoever built this intentionally put all this coral and, and all this crap everywhere. But it is now all cleaned up. Once again, minus the fish. So I'll take care of that. And then we'll go help who uh, whoever's at the pump wrap me out. Oh, hey. Convenient timing. I was actually just about to leave. You pulled up right on schedule. Go ahead. Get your hose on there. There we are. All right. You should be good to go, brother. Our next task is to buy a parking lot. I thought it said parking spot. As in just one. But no, a, a, a full parking lot. You too, sir. Thanks for stopping by. Yeah, the, the waves are really starting to pick up now. It's it's high tide. The volcano is getting a bit angy. He's not ready to erupt just yet, but he, he is definitely getting rather angy. First one's free. Oh, you guys can't probably see that. It, it's probably right behind me. But there we are. Our very own parking lot. Let's go check that out real quick. Where did it even put it? Is this it? Wait. For real? This is... Okay. Okay. I, I'm not going to judge. I'm not going to judge. I don't know how they design parking lots in this neck of the woods. I guess just like that. Is that a workshop? And then this could potentially be a car wash. And it was once upon a time. All right. We'll get those. We'll get both of those things up and running in due time. Boats fueled and shop customers served. Well, I would love to serve this customer coming to our shop, but we don't have anything. We have nothing. Let's fix that. We have $1,700 at our disposal, so I'm going to get the big soft drink stand, just one, and then the big food stand. Again, just one of those. Now we need some products. Let's go Peepis, uh, Naranja, Mr. Burton, and Tropicolo. Just seems fitting. As for snacks, we're getting Chips Way, some Oreos, the Paprika Chips, and popcorn. Always, always a crowd favorite. All right, let's check it out. Insufficient 
warehouse capacity. Uh-oh. We might be able to upgrade our warehouse for $250. Oh, additional quest progress needed. Dang it, dude. Okay, so we're just gonna, we're gonna have to buy a little bit less. This should be enough. There it is. Okay. Uh, delivery in routes, but we still have to get our shelves up. Wait, where did our one customer go? What the heck are these people doing? They're walking up. We don't have a bathroom. They're not going to go, like, on the beach or anything, right? No, they're walking up and then just immediately turning around because we have nothing to offer them. I'm going to put our snack shelf right there. Head back into our inventory. We've got the drinks shelf next. I think I'm going to put that in between these two windows. I'll try to get it as, as straight as I can. That looks halfway decent anyways. It's never going to be perfect, you know? But we can try. We can certainly try. Okay, we are ready for our shipment, which is almost here. I just realized that our checkout counter is also an old surfboard or something. That's pretty cool. Oh my god, there's been a guy out here for I don't even know how long, sir. I am so sorry. You too. At least he was nice about it. Oh, and there's our sick little delivery vessel. It looks more like a canoe than a than a proper boat. Oh no, I guess it's it's got a little engine and, and stuff. Alright, so we just have to grab this out of your boat then, huh? Easy. Easy. Thank you, sir. Okay, time to stock some shelves. We're gonna do 10 of those on the bottom. 10, 10, and then 10, and then 10. You know what? Let's just let's just place all. Yeah, that's that's quite a bit easier. It's it's not gonna be organized, but that's okay. You know, we only bought the one shelf, and we'll do the same thing for the soda. Beautiful. Okay, at least now we actually have something to offer the people driving in, because again, we don't have a uh, a land pump. Is there like a bell or something when when people arrive? There's been a jet ski dude down here. Sir, I'm so sorry. I am so sorry. I really need to find some help, don't I? You too, sir. Just somebody to man the pump would be nice. We do have a new email. Maybe we check that out while we wait for... Yeah, customers to start coming into the shop. I love it. Nothing here for us in the email. Just uh, kind of telling us how to do stuff. How we doing today, sir? You having a good day so far? Excellent. But now that you got your food, you're all set, right? Right, okay. How about you, sir? Find everything okay? I know we, we, we got a lot to choose from. Maybe too many products. Just as you wanted. All right, sir. I kind of want to try to turn this off. Is there a way that we could do that somehow? Another jet ski today. Almost didn't see you there, sir. Almost missed you. I was worried we'd be stranded. Well, okay. Now, only now does that line actually make sense. Because he came in for a fuel. But when they say it, when they're just grabbing some chips or some sodas, doesn't make a lick of sense. Uh, what? <laughs> okay. I had to do it again, just to confirm. But if you stand on a barrel and then pick it up out of the sand, oops, uh, you do fly. You definitely do take flight. I don't know that I would count this as a bug. I, I'm pretty sure it happened at the other gas station as well. It's, dude, it's just, oh, Jesus Christ. Okay, it really sped up there. Wait, can he make it? No. Very short. That was very, very short. I'm not going to litter into the ocean. Don't worry. We'll pick it up and, and throw it into the dumpster. Afternoon, sir. You didn't happen to see us flying through the air, right? No, of course not. We can't fly. That's crazy. Have a nice day. You too. Hello, ma'am. Got the essentials here today, I see. Yeah, very cool. What's up with you? You having a good day? All right. Glad to hear it, brother. You're a lifesaver. Life there it is. A little bit different voice, but the, the sentiment was there. I'm going to place another quick fuel order and another round of garbage collection. I'm pretty sure I just heard somebody else pull up to the pump. Sure did. What's going on, brother? I also like that there are different types of boats. Something about that. That'll do. Enjoy your day, sir. We've just got to help one more customer in the shop. Oh, what the heck did I do that for? 
And then we've got this challenge finished. I owe you one, sir. Thank you so much for helping us out with that. On to the next. Mammy, find everything okay? Good deal. Getting a couple of things for the road, I see. Quite a few things. You too, ma'am. Appreciate it. Got another boat that just pulled up. Only a 70 horse? What are you, some kind of pansy? You need to get dual 250s or dual 500s at least, brother. Chun Chumanchu, our volcano friend, is getting more and more angry by the minute. And I don't really even know what we're meant to, to offer to the volcano so he doesn't, you know, blow his lid. Uh, 250 for gas station level two. Toilet, new shelves, new decorations, scuba diving, additional fuel dispenser, and employee trailer. Well, we definitely need that, but it comes with a whole bunch of perks that I was not expecting. So now we have the area. Oh. The volcano's chilling. If we upgrade, it relaxes. Okay, that's good to know. That is good to know, but we probably need other, like, sacrifices, if I had to guess. We've got another customer back here at Fuel. Is it one of the flat bottom boats? No, different style this time. Oh no, never mind. It is a flat bottom. So yeah, we've got the area here for pumps, but now we actually have to buy said pumps. So we're probably going to do that in features? Yes. Fuel dispenser right there. 250 bones. We're probably going to want to like increase our, our total fuel capacity then. Or at least... Maybe just order more than we are right now. I don't I don't really know what our current capacity even is. We're at 42%. Oh, 200? Never mind. Yeah, we're, we're good. But we, we definitely need another delivery. So let's get that coming right meow. Our first car customer. Ma'am, how you doing today? Oh, we gotta... Yep, gotta wait for you to stand over there awkwardly in the corner. There we are. Got 17 gallons for you. That is great. You are welcome, ma'am. Enjoy your day. I was wondering where the, the party bus aspect was going to come into play. If it was still going to be a bus or if it's going to be a boat now. It looks like it's going to be a boat. Or maybe both. But that costs $1,000. Afternoon, Ossifer. How we doing? Good. Lifesaver. You're a lifesaver, sir. Thank you for your service. Fueling superstar. Oh, scuba equipment rental. Okay, so there's got to be more uh, upgrades in here. Or like, is that a feature thing? No, surely. Yeah, that's an upgrade. Okay. So what else do we have? Warehouse 2. Toilet level 1. Let's do that. I think people, you know, they could use a potty. It's not the nicest looking thing, but it's it's something. And again, we're, we're calming the volcano. We get it, you vape. Thank you for the smoke rings. Now at least we know that it's chilled out a little bit. God, dude, I honestly forgot just how fun this game can be. You know, like the the other one, the, the one in the Dust Bowl, the one that we've managed for literal years now, That's it's fun, but like we kind of peaked there. And it's nice to be able to start over from scratch. I know most, most of the time people wouldn't be into that. They would want to keep all their levels, all their old equipment, you know, s stuff along those lines. But a fresh start, especially in a game like this, is is very good. Very, very good. Next upgrade has to be the scuba diving gear, dude. That is just a way too sick. We've got a little spot over there on the coast, on the beach. We'll go check that out. And again, we're pleasing the volcano. All in a day's work. Just don't tell me that we're gonna have to like clean this place up a whole bunch too. No, it looks looks pretty fresh. Uh, 20% chance of death? So if we increase that, it decreases the chance of death. Let's just leave it since 50% was the default. Let's leave it at that for now and we'll see how that see how that goes, I guess. But we do also have to, hey, you gonna go rent some scuba gear? Only a 20% chance of I need to see about getting a, like, camper so we could at least get one employee. We're already spread a little thin, I think. New equipment at... Oh, no equipment! Here we go. Scuba diving equipment. 20 bucks a pop. That's really not too terrible. 
I don't know how much we can fit over there, but I'm gonna order like 10 of them. Seems pretty good to me. The scuba gear has arrived, ladies and gentlemen. There we are. Thank you so much, sir. I probably should have ordered other things as well. Uh, not just scuba gear. Oh, hang on. Let me just jump on over there. Hardcore parkour it up. And we'll fill up your tank real, you're amazing. real quick. You're amazing. I honestly thought he was going to say, you're a lifesaver. Holy line. Okay. Uh, how do I actually place our gear? Oh, it's like a separate... It's like a separate little thing entirely, isn't it? Yeah, we're probably we're probably going to need like an actual shelf to put this stuff on. I don't think just dropping it on the floor is is going to do any good. I was just trying to read my email simply to get the notification to disappear and I see this. Shark. A dangerous shark has been prowling the area for years. The moment the shark is spotted by the coast guard, sirens will sound on the island. If you do not intervene, the shark will attack a few people in the water dude we don't we don't want that to happen we definitely don't want that to happen and i did notice uh in addition to being able to buy a paint roller or a lock pick there is also a vintage cannon so very very excited to check that out but i think oh wait 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 we have to get the scuba gear thing first and then i want to go check out the the toiletry situation Okay, all I see is tobacco, alcohol, and ice cream in addition to our snack shelves. Where do I get the... What the heck? Where do I get the scuba gear stand thing? What am I missing? I don't see it in the store anywhere. We've... We've got this right here. Add all. Where are these people even going? They're going through this door here, but what's on the... What's on the backside? Oh, that's their changing room, and then they just disappear. They just straight up vanish. But they're probably diving on that buoy out there, if I had to guess. I am so incredibly sorry for the wait, sir. Had this whole ordeal happen out at the scuba shop. He gets it. This guy, he gets it. The last thing that I want to check out today is just the toilet situation. Okay, that's not great. Not very inviting. Maybe if we open up more uh, more stalls, that'll kind of clean up itself. But we have one toilet. Once again, we're not actually able to go inside, but there's, there's definitely one toilet surrounded by a bunch of corrugated steel. That's definitely not safe. And it's actually a big bench with just a hole in it. So does that mean... Does that mean it's just going on to the beach back here? Because I don't see any plumbing. I know we're super, super close to being able to finish out that challenge. But unfortunately, it's not going to happen today. But it gives us something to look forward to for the next episode. So with that, I do think that's where we're going to wind things down at for today. But once again, if you guys did enjoy, please leave a like, leave a comment. Help support the dream by smashing that subscribe button. And I will see you in the next one. Thanks so much for watching, guys. Peace.